hand in my eyes. Okay. So, like, he's, he was the uh, head of the Paul Smash for a while now. He's graduated. He's okay. out in the world. This is the first time I've seen him in a while, too. Okay. Going up against Arctis. Th these two characters are very, very volatile. They basically like do the exact Absolutely. same thing. Cut they look for combo. they look for their starter and then they just go crazy. And that's one thing I think people have started to realize in uh, Smash that uh, Punish game is a lot more favorable than overall like kit. You know, like that Punish game, the characters that are winning are ones that have the touch of death, like Kazuya. Kazuya probably having one of the most busted of them. Um, and Falcon also starting out uh, as like almost a touch of death character. You remember the day one. Um, Right there, easy confirmed to Kazi as well. Forward there too. Arc just trying to find it. He's in the advantage state, but let's uh, Matt Beach get back down onto the uh, center stage. Okay, Had a read waiting, there. Yeah, waiting for the air dodge there. Kind of getting snuffed out by the Kazi. Sur surprisingly quick frame data. Yeah, I'll be out of shield. You know, take it. It's Matt Beach, only 26%. Oh, another electric. Mix ups. Yeah. Drag down, down back four. Okay, try to look for the extension. Oh, my God. oh wow, what a chase! Reverse, yeah. Okay, try to get the double nair one. That's that's one I see Arctis use a lot. Very, very good against all characters. Kind of just drifts out there, gets a back air, evens up his stock count, but not quite the percent. Oh yeah, just wow! Like that. Yep, and dragon yeah. uppercut <laughs> lands onto the dragon uppercut. Yeah. That's the thing when. You Kazuya is doing his movement options. You gotta have to respect it because yeah. anytime you get out of crouch dash, you can mix up with that. It's the classic Mishima mix-up. Yeah. You can mix up with electric. You can mix up with uh, just into a normal. Oh, he had the read there. And that's just the thing. Like a lot of these characters, a lot of the characters in this game, like Falcon, probably are terrified, going in terrified against Kazuya because you have to get up close and personal with him. You know, you have to land those hits. Arctis with his string still. Putting on the pressure. Time for the, for the trap. Oh, oh no, I don't think this is bad. Right. This is very bad. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. There nice you go. Get, get back, back here. grab, and that's going to be it. Arctis trying to make this, make this slight comeback. Not too much. Let's see if that's. Ah. Oh. Yep. Miss space and aerial. Yeah. That's a free electric into an up smash. Electric. Yep. The, the electric wind got the. the the Holy Grail. That's the electrics, man. <laughs> when you're in electrics, don't be in y'all saunas. Exactly. You, you got to watch it. Uh, but, I mean, still, again, all, like, game one, one still relatively close. The one thing I've loved seeing from Matt recently, especially, is just the utilization of movement. That, that, honestly, yeah. out of all the top tiers to watch, Kazuya is my favorite, simply because he has movement options that nobody in the game has moving options yeah, no, otherwise. Absolutely. And just utilization, that's why I love watching Riddles at a high level because you just see that character move in a way that nobody else, it's kind of like watching a melee character play in a game that isn't melee. Yeah, no, it's, it's scary. It's scary, you realize, like, Kazuya just has all these strong moves that you could just throw. Almost got that read, almost got that. That's one of the classics. Yeah, the flash punch combo, really good to kind of use as a jab check. It's very much just like the Mishima style of, yeah. again, that's one thing that you do out of like a crash deck mix up, especially if you manage to get something that's unsafe on block, they have that 1-1-2 one, one, to just kind of get you off. Right. Archive. Yep. He just uh, electric. <laughs> no fear. Throwing out electrics as he's coming at you with the yeah, Raptor boost. Not quite at the percent for the up smash to follow up through. Um, let's see here. Off stage, going to get to the middle. Rage drive on deck, though. It's going to be scary for Arctis. I imagine Mad Beast is going to save it for the next stock, though. So it's a free 40%. It's here. If he's got the opportunity to use it, he will burn it. It's just a matter of if Arctis is going to be playing. Very nice air dodge. Doesn't get the back air. 128%. Nice. Now, okay, here we go. Now, we're either going to see an early kill or a 40%. Great oh, back air okay. that removes the rage drive, but rage itself is still present. Another attempt at a ledge trump, but Matt Beach buffering to jump in. The raw cup can almost work. If you got the sweet spot. Looking for something here. Oh, wow. To Anti air jab. It doesn't get the spike hitbox there. Oh, yeah. wow. Whipped on the grab. Right. Yeah. And just get it. 
that back air is going to close out that stock from Arctis. He doesn't have the stock. No. Okay, only 53%. See if he can get it up. Up throw. Okay, kind of waits. See what's going on there. Even percents now. Is that going to be death? Absolutely. Yes, there you is. go. Arctis yeah. waking up, that, that's the, that is the volatility of Kazuya. He's at that perfect weight where Falcon, all he really needs, even if you DI it properly, you get in one of those strings, it's going yeah. to be death. We're going to see another one here. All right, Arctis looking for the, all right, up there, up there, near one. Keep Chasing the with the going. air dodge read. Up the out of shield, up, manages up, to get him off. Can Arctis close this one out? Oh, neutral air. Go watch it. A little scary. Oh, that back four. Keeping a little bit of invincibility to keep it up from him. Another electric on right. shield. All right, knee. Yep. That's, That's going to take it. it. Yep. Right before raids, Arctis responding with a two stock. Going to be a pretty solid game. 1-1 one, one here. Let's see what's going to be happening in game three. So that's kind of the Achilles heel of Kazuya, is just his disadvantage state. There's a lot of characters that can really, really, like it's kind of the story with all fighting game characters where their disadvantage state is notoriously bad. Dude, I just saw the stage pick. This is, I don't know how to feel about this because it's like, this is like one of Falcon's best stage. This is easily probably one of Kazuya's best stage. He basically has FD. I about to say, it, it's, it's a, it's a counter pick, but at the same time it's not because it's, both characters kind of thrive on sure. this. Yeah, they kind of, they both benefit. So I'm, I'm curious to see how this is going to go. You know, is it ultimately going to favor Arctis or is it going to, I know Arctis can get those uh, wall jump recoveries as well as to kind of mix up, um, get a lot of weird wall jump uh, shenanigans going on. Oh, doesn't get the drag down on the nair, but still follows with the wind fist. No electric this time. And that beach right away trying to take advantage of that, that flat stage. Three electrics for days. Yep. Running three, follow up on the tech chase. Okay. Oh, again, that one, single hit one. Nair. Maybe? Yeah, that that's going to be it. That just leads to such big damage and a huge combo that basically leads to death. It's right. like, all right, you got your zero to death. I got them too, boy. Right now, the stage pick looking in favor of Arctis. Again, that, that advantage state from Falcon, he will he will touch you just the same and kill you. It's a thing, there. And the thing that's crazy is that Falcon has longer limbs and longer normals to reach Kazuya Maybe. out of range of it. Th two stock lead. Well, that, Right away, again. This could easily turn around, but let's see if Arctis is going to keep this lead extended. Up smash, raw, not going to kill. Kalos having a high ceiling. Very First. patient on that, but the soft knee not going to close it out. Another big gonna back air. Dodge. He's going to go deep for it. And that's gonna, I think that's going to be it. Yeah, that's it. That's, that's it. it. Arctis with the 2-1. Oh, with wow. With dominating third game. Oh, my goodness. That was a three stock, wasn't it? That was. That was, that, yeah. That was a three very, very convincing like three stock. Very like, hey, convincing. You know what? I, I feel like that was like an attempt at a counter pick, and I think Arctis was just like, all right, well. Yeah, it worked in his favor. He was like, all right, take I know the you, I know you get. I know you get here, but you know what? That, like, let, let's try it out. And I mean, man, like, you know, honestly, good stuff to Matt Beach. You fought yeah, really hard. And, very um, close. Yeah, very close. Anytime side. I see, like, he has improved so much with Kazuya. Like, he's not, like, a genuine threat to anybody he plays. Like, and honestly, that's, like, the point of the game. Yeah, that's. There you I'm go. I'm proud of him. Any any Kazuya <laughs> you see, it's almost like, because you know if they're playing Kazuya, they've labbed when got the combos. Oh Even my if God, their neutral yeah. isn't great, if they have those combos tight and on point, you almost don't need to have like some of the extra stuff, you know? It's got a lot of tools, just kind of mix them up on there. Yes, please. Yeah, always, always. Let's see some of those combos, dude, on both ends, Kazuya. Yeah, so electric on shield, yeah. Yeah. See, that's the, that's the thing about Falcon is that he's just got such disjointed normals in the air. It just allows him to really exploit the, the really era. poor disadvantage state that fighting in characters have. That's the soft knee. And right here, this is what I was talking about, that, you know, the, the wall jump shenanigans got the nair there. Or the, yeah, yeah the nair to push him off. Exploited just far all enough. of that and was just barely out of yeah. range. You hate to see that. Barely out of range. And on that stage specifically, I also like wish that you could cho choose what music you can because that stage needs Claudio's music anytime the Cla yeah, yeah, Cosmos yeah, is on yeah. there. It's like because th I think that's a track that was imported from Tekken 7 to Smash, unless I'm 